the end of summer approaching, a lot of people are heading to the beach this weekend. However, after more than 100 people were stung by jellyfish just last weekend at Myrtle Beach, we were wondering, what about our waters? News 2's Travis Rice live on Sullivan's Island with more. Travis. Hey, good evening, Brendan. It's hit or miss depending on what beach in the low country you go to, but jellyfish brooms are jellyfish blooms are very serious and if you get stung by one it really hurts. At first it was just a little bite and then the whole leg went numb. Nicole Gollin is getting over getting stung. It was about two weeks ago. She's tried just about everything to get rid of the pain. Well my friend tried to pee on it but then he peed on the wrong leg. Everything. So your friend peed on your leg? Yeah but the wrong one so I got peed on for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> so you do see a lot of more of them being pushed that way. Professionals we spoke to say most of the stings are happening at one place. More silent. This flag at Folly Beach means stay away from the pier, but the purple ones for jellyfish are put away for now. Um, for what I've seen, we've had a pretty big decrease in, uh, in frequency and in uh, severity and stings. Max Hutton has been a lifeguard here for four years, and he remembers when one got him. You know you get stung. It's very, it's immediate. It's not like an electric shock, but it is, it is almost. Yeah. Better than getting made by a shark. Yeah, much significantly better than that. It's jellyfish like these blooming in droves up and down the Carolina coast. Scientists say it's nothing new. Isn't this just prime jellyfish time? Yes, it is. It is. They definitely are seasonal. We have several species that sting in our waters right now. Wildlife biologist Shannon Howard says your choices are limited for avoiding stinks. They can stay out of the water. If you don't want to stay out of the water, you can wear a skin, like a dive skin, to protect your skin. Yeah, I'm from Massachusetts. I'm not on the water often. And even a jellyfish first-timer knows this is summer at the beach. Um, I still go back. I went last weekend. I was just a little more cautious. Forgive the tongue twister off the top. The exposure to the salt water is starting to get to me after today. DNR says the reason why there are so many jellyfish, jellyfish up here, there it is again, the reason why there's so many jellyfish up here is, of course, because the water temperature is so warm this time of year. Live in Sullivan's Island, Travis Rice, News 2.